Packers got tangled up and fell. Bobby Harrison has a chance to drive in now. Taps one on goal, save and the rebound. McCarr is denied by Ashton Abel. And if you look at the percentage of current NHL players that came through the junior A and college routes in both the U.S. and Canada, it's amazing how much it's gone up. Phillips with a drive and that'll open the scoring for the North Carolinian number 12 of the Bandits. Blasting one from the high slot. Again, Abel was screened. I don't think he had a good look at that shot, but number 12 of the Bandits, the Raleigh North Carolina native gets his team on the board first. A nice shot by Phillips, uh, the kid from the Tar Heel State in North Carolina. Of course, uh, last year we had a, a real special guy here from Went North off a body. Phillips again now, put it in front for Bates, and he just missed, but what a rocket of a shot. Front there by Mitchell Watson, before he could get to that puck and allows the Oilers to counterattack. Cody got knocked down. And especially me. <laughs> <laughs> Another two on one here, McCarr. Good gloves stop that time by Ashton Abel. But now a two on one again though. This is Trey Thomas to Hernandez and a great stop by Abel. Nice spin by Harrison. Got it out to DeSico again. Lots of room at the point. Over to Japchen. Nice shot, he scores! <laughs> the point shot by Greg Japchen just finds its way inside the left post and the Bandits have made it a two nothing game. And I think Pappas may have got a tip on it as he's headed by first. Jordan DeSico. Now McGowan, nice shot through a screen, good save Charleston. The rebound, Bushland scores! Charleston had a bit of trouble corralling that rebound and still no bouncing around. Kufus is able to get to it in the circle. Shoots in a nice glove snag by goaltender Charleston. Oh, deflected off him but right to Thomas. Nice backdoor feed and the shot by Krieger is robbed by Ashton Abel. Is it? Now it's Waugh. Nice shot, and that's right on rebound. Harrison scores! <laughs> it won't be a power play goal, but it will be Bobby Harrison reclaiming a two-goal advantage for the Brooks Bandits. Bobby Harrison, uh, a left-hand shot on the right side using great reaction as he battles in front of the net, gets into that scoring space. He just backs off a little bit. Doesn't get, get in the traffic, picks the rebound up, makes no mistake. A, a great shot, patient, lets the goaltender go down and throws it up top over. So Bobby Harrison gets for your time. <laughs> Phillips gave it to the near side. Now Reeves, he had the net open, couldn't get it through. The wraparound's denied as well by... Walk to Hernandez. Lots of space for the speedy Floridian. But the shot went out the skate of Bernard Docker. Hernandez evades that stick uh, slash and weaves his way up the wall. Hernandez right to the high slot with some space to fire. Scores! <laughs> well, that's what happens when you leave a skilled player like Randy Hernandez to skate around the old zone entirely untouched. He gets to the high slot. The screen forms in front of Abel, and it's a 4-1 bandit lead. The Bandits have had really good traffic in front of Abel tonight, and Hernandez just lets a long wrister go. Well placed, though, it may have it by Pappas. Two on one with McCarr. We've heard this a lot tonight. Overskated it, but Coleman backed him up, and that is another good stop by Ashton Abel on the point blank try by the Bandit defenseman. Coleman's waltz is around the line, and he just fired that one wide as well. Coleman's ability to, to run the blue line and continue to hold the puck is... Harrison scores again! And the ripper from the left circle will give the Bandits a 5-1 to one lead. Helped in no small part by Coolman's able to walk the line and keep that puck in. And the end result is a perfect shot by Harrison. Friday, 6 o'clock Mountain on the Saturday. Here's Hagen with a point blank try right on. Rebound, it's light on the goal line! Charleston's on top of it and there's no goal! On the Sunday. So for Alberta viewers, well of course, almost another goal. Morrison wings it, brings it off the crossbar. With the school they eventually commit to. Of course, we got James on a breakaway here. Shoots. What a glove snag by Charleston. The program forward as well. Another two on one here. Thomas with Krieger. Thomas to Krieger. Shoots. And what did that go off? Either Parker facing the wrong way or the D-man who was in front of him. Post banner last year, so they got that out of the way at least. Hagen dangles to the slot. Wires it off the crossbar. What by Thomas though, and now Tim Rigo can no turn it over to Kufus, who's got another breakaway. Scores! 
A giveaway by Brooks at their own blue line and TJ. He showed a great affinity for those nifty little touch passes as Hernandez makes the steal, shoots, great save, Parker. To keep it in nicely, gave it to DeSico, lots of space, backdoor jab, you know, oh, it was just out of his reach. A good plays in the defensive zone that earn you a lot of looks from the coaching staff in games like this. Kuhlman drives down low, put it back to Lee, scores! <laughs> Bernard Docker sends it in deep. It's an undefeated start to the preseason for the Brooks Bandits. A 6-2 final score here at the CRA. And this roster is looking awfully strong to start things off.